I love to see plants growing. I feel proud. 12th grader Ja Rule may be nonverbal, but his pride and enthusiasm for farming are unmistakable. Ja Rule, which tool checks the water's nutrient or food level? E C C M E T E R E C meter. Very good. Which one's the E C meter? Dave Ma. Excellent job, Ja Rule. Ja Rule is one of 16 special needs students here at Q721 Public High School in Elmhurst, Queens, learning all about hydroponic farming right inside the classroom. We take our data, so we check the pH levels, we check the electroconductivity, which tells us the mineral nutrient level, because with hydroponics, we're not using any soil. We're using just water and the students add nutrients when needed. Special education teacher Connor Barry swears he had no hydroponics background before teaching this class. He sure fooled us. Christian, can you tell us the three hydroponic systems that we have in our classroom? The vine crop, the tower garden, the tower garden and the NFT. What are we growing over in the vine crop, Christian? The nonprofit New York Sunworks trained teachers and set up this farming program in nearly 200 schools throughout the five boroughs and New Jersey. About 65,000 students K through 12 are harvesting crops this school year. They're learning core science. They're also learning sustainability. They're learning about water conservation. They're learning about the impact of different types of farming on the environment. 18 year old Christian shares with us his favorite crops to grow. Eggplant, snow peas, argula, peppers, tomatoes, cucumber. His classmate Javier also expressing a strong passion for this unique opportunity. I love to see the science of growing the garden of vegetables. It is amazing. We are scientists in Mr. Barry's hydroponics class. It meets their different sensory needs. For our students who are visually impaired, they're able to hear the water throughout the day. Raining down in the tower garden, they're able to taste the vegetables, to smell the vegetables, to, to feel what they're doing. So it's a very hands-on program. After growing the produce, the students will have another special culinary class. These young farmers will actually have the chance to cook and then sell their produce to students and staff in the building. The long-term goal is to actually harvest fish right here at the school. In Elmhurst, Queens, Dana Arshin, Fox 5 News.